To commemorate the founding of New Orleans in 1718, WYES presents this tricentennial moment in celebration of our city's past and present. Celebration in the Oaks is a big fundraiser for the park. It began in 1984 when board member Mary Rogers floated the idea of a tribute to the Christmas tree. You know, I knew it was an event that either had to grow or was going to die, so um, I had been working with Angela Hill on some projects and I called Angela and she helped uh, get it started um, by getting WWL. It was called Christmas in the Oaks and Channel 4 became the television sponsor and uh, along with Entergy. In 1990, Christmas in the Oaks had a new name, the more inclusive Celebration in the Oaks. WVUE Fox 8 is a current sponsor. And much of Celebration's success has been due to volunteers, such as Barbara Hammett and Janet LaRue, who chaired the event for 14 years. I think that walking through there, there's something about the lighting among those trees in such a small area, a relatively small area, that literally makes you think that you're in a fairy tale. My parents came to town and the train was running. I said, we're gonna do the train. <laughs> and I remembered looking at their faces. Look at this, no matter how I would describe what it was, for them to see it at that age, marvel. I said, from out of town, how magnificent is this? That is such a profound memory. I think my favorite memory was the year that City Park brought back Mr. Bingle. It just brought back all those wonderful memories of going to Canal Street and seeing Mr. Bingle. And he is still a favorite at a Celebration of the Oaks. WYS's New Orleans Tricentennial Moments are brought to you by the Miro Foundation and presented in association with the historic New Orleans Collection.